My name is Devin Mackey, and I'm a neuroophthalmologist at Indiana University. Idiopathic intracranial hypertension is a disorder in which the fluid that flows in and around the brain develops high pressure. The high pressure can cause symptoms like headaches, a whooshing sound in the ears, decreased or double vision, and even neck and back pain. It is most common in women in their childbearing years and is often associated with weight gain. The fluid under high pressure usually squeezes the optic nerves, which can be noticed when a healthcare provider, usually an eye doctor, looks in the eyes during an examination. Optic nerve swelling can lead to decreased vision and when especially severe, can even cause permanent vision damage. Vision function and the severity of optic nerve swelling can be monitored by an eye doctor. Worsening of vision, optic nerve swelling, or a patient's symptoms may require a change in treatment. One of the most effective treatments is weight loss. Acetazolamide is also used in many cases and helps decrease the production of the cerebrospinal fluid that is under high pressure. Other medications are also sometimes used. When vision loss worsens despite best efforts at weight loss and the use of medications, surgery may be necessary. You can find patient information brochures on idiopathic intracranial hypertension and other neuroophthalmic disorders at www.nanosweb.org patients.